Hello, hello, my beautiful friends. This is Bev, AKA Momo B. Today we're going to be unboxing a new to me company called Dreamer Designs. This is the first time I've ever ordered from them. I did take advantage of their Black Friday sale. So this is just one of the paintings that I ordered on their sale. I will have another unboxing on my channel later on. First, let's take a look at this one. I have never gotten a Dreamer Designs kit, like I said, so I'm kind of nervous, kind of excited, kind of both. It came, this box came in another box, which was cool, because it was arrived safely. If you've never seen a Dreamer Designs box in person, just like me, here it is. Premium diamond painting canvas, Y diamond paint, the contents of what's inside. Here's some instructions. And I was kind of confused because I was like, well, how am I supposed to know which kit is which? Because there's no image on the, the box itself. So I was like, okay, which one am I unboxing? But then I saw on the bottom, there is a little sticker that they put. And this is what I'm going to be unboxing. It's called Kindred Spirit from Regan Kubisek. Ruben Kubisek, yes. And it's a 60 by 80, so it is pretty large. I'm going to have to definitely do this on the floor, but let's open it up and see what's inside. Sorry, I just wanted to see. I was like, oh my God, there's the handle everyone talks about. Let's open it up from the top. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, so nice and fancy. If you can hear a motor in the background, that is just my landlord. I do live above a garage and a loft. So that is him revving his motorcycle, doing man things. So it comes in a bag, which is really nice and soft. Nice to store your diamond painting in. Ooh, the toolkit bag is really, really soft. Let's take a look what's inside the toolkit. I've never seen a Dreamer Designs toolkit, so it's interesting to open one. Okay, so first we have a tray, two trays, and they are branded is nice very nice a squishy that's purple purple is my favorite color a diamond painting pen another diamond painting pen but this time with a plastic end I'm very curious I'm gonna try this later today because I've never diamond painted with a pen like that some tweezers that are branded it's another squishy a little container of wax come on come on Okay, another container of wax, a lot of baggies, and some multi-placers. So these are like the, the not good multi-placers. There's ones that are like white color, they're not translucent, and those are the good ones because they're thinner. These ones I find don't work very well for me personally, but there's also a place, what is it? I was like multi-placer. No, it's a alignment tool to align. I can't think of the name. Drop a comment below if you can tell me what the name is of this. I can't remember. Not off the top of my head. I was like, what is the word? I have no idea. So I'm just gonna put this all away really quickly. Dude keeps revving his engine. Sorry if you can hear that, but I am tackling daylight here. What else is in here? Okay, so here we have our drills another thing of drills and here is our lovely canvas Ooh, okay let's put the drills aside for now Ooh, I feel like you know when you go to a new building and then they cut the ribbon and they have like a ribbon cutting ceremony basically that's how I feel right now Ooh, I'm pretty excited Please don't disappoint me, Dreamer Designs. Ooh, she's a big one. She's a big girl. She's thick. Oh my god, her face is so cute. Okay, I guess before we open all of her, let's take a look at this. Here is... Is this a sticker? Is it a sticker? Can someone confirm? 
is this thing a sticker? I feel like it is a sticker, but I feel like maybe it's not. I don't know. Because I can't undo it. Someone confirm. Is this a sticker, please? So we have, whoa, 51 colors. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's a lot of colors. And then there's a sheet that you guys probably don't care about, but it's just like about how to diamond paint and their community online. I know you guys don't care about that. I'm just going to roll it the other way so we can look at it flat on the ground. Hi, so we're on our fl my floor right now. This is Kindred Spirit, legally licensed from Regan Kubasek. She reminds me of like Anne of Green Gables. Is that what she's supposed to be? Because, I mean, she's a redhead and she's in a field, like a farm. Is she supposed to be Anne of Green Gables? I have no idea. So let's take a closer look. See if I can do a little toursy. She's beautiful. So that was my aerial shot of her. Hopefully I don't make the camera fall. And in the top right hand corner, we have right there in the top right hand corner, we have the social media handles for Dreamer Designs. We have a schematic. And then on the bottom left hand corner, we have the schematic as well. And then it says paint with passion. Let's take a look at the drill field. Let's bring it up close, close. The drill field does look clear to me. Um, this is her sweater. I don't see anything that would be considered blurry mixture of letters, numbers, and symbols. Everything does look clear to me. Let's look at the detail in her face. And I love, I love the details, like the house. There's the crop field over there, the trees. Her sweater kind of looks like earth. I don't know if that's just me. It looks like the globe, like earth. Like there's the little islands and countries. Okay, we're back. So here we are at the table. Again, someone tell me, is this a sticker? I'm sure I'll figure it out later, but I just want to know. Is it a sticker? Tell me. Let's open up the drills. It looks like there's some ABs. Come on. Oh yeah, there are some ABs. Okay. So it looks like AB08 and AB38. So this would be AB08, which is this white color. Can't really tell it's an AB in the camera. Kind of. And then AB38 is this green color. And then, I don't know, do I want to go through the entire drill thing? I'm not going to go through all of the drills, but you can see there's just a mixture of colors. There's oranges, some blues, her skin tone, I'm guessing, pinks, and lots of green for the foliage. Foliage, foliage is such a weird word. I ripped the bag. <laughs> so I got a little too excited and ripped the bag that the drills go in. So that's the first bag of drills. Here's the second bag. You can kind of take a look. Some browns and oranges. So like really fall colors. Some greens. And yeah, I will let you guys know how the, ooh, I thought that was a bug. I was like, oh my God, there's a bug inside. Gross, I'm gonna die. But it's actually just part of, it's like a telescope. It's part of the packaging. I was so grossed out. Okay, but I wanna see where those AB goes, ABs go. 
H is in her eyes. So we'll see some in her eyes, which is the white AB. They're all along in the garden here. Where would be the green? Oh, the nines are also in her eyes, so I am blind apparently. So the nines are here. So the white and the green, the light green will be ABs in her eyes. And I think that's it for the nines. Oh, and then down here, there's also some of those white ABs wherever H is. That's going to be white ABs too. Not a whole lot for the green though. I think the green is literally just in her eyes. But when I do it, I'll let, I'll let you guys know. I'll do a post review. I don't know when I'm going to get to this, but I will eventually. I'm really excited. I'm happy with it. Like I was actually really nervous about it just because I've seen other people's unboxings and they're kind of disappointed with their Dreamer Designs kits. So this is my first order. I was sad because I actually had to go to the post office in order to pick it up. And usually when I get diamond paintings, they just come right to my door and I don't have to worry about that. But I did have to go to the post office and I did have to pay duties of $16 for two paintings. So if you are in Canada, just beware that you may have to pay customs on your orders. I mean, like it's weird that I have to pay customs on dream, like this order when I can order and spend way more on Diamond Art Club and not have to pay customs. But who knows, who knows, who knows. If you like this unboxing, please hit the thumbs up if this was helpful to you. And please consider subscribing if you're new here. I would love to have you as one of my subscribers. I'm gonna call you guys the Hive, cause Momo B. So the Hive people, I don't know, is that lame? Leave a comment if you think that's lame, if you're like, oh, I don't wanna be part of your Hive, that sounds lame. So anyways subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much for watching.